Welcome back to our channel, where we explore the intersection of technology and education. Today, we are diving into the fascinating journey of Computer Assisted Language Learning or CALL. Now, let's take a journey back in time to explore the early days of CALL and how it has evolved over the years. Early Days of CALL Back in the day, language learning relied heavily on text accompanied by audio and visual materials. The emphasis was placed on oral communication skills, and the use of audiovisual materials increased. In the 1950s, we saw the influence of behaviorist learning theory and the audiolingual method. Language labs, with cylinder recordings and phonograph records, were instrumental in teaching languages. This marked the beginnings of call. But what kind of language activities were available during this era? Language activities During the early days of call, language learners had access to vocabulary flashcards, text-based grammar drill and practice exercises, often uncontextualized, and translation exercises. Computers were slowly developing, but their use in language learning was limited because the focus was on communication-focused methods. As we move forward, we see the emergence of interactivity and authenticity in language learning. Interactivity and Authenticity In the 1980s, microcomputers started making their way into language classrooms. Commercialized and accessible, they brought about a significant shift in language education. Instructional technologies for languages expanded to include films, audio tapes, pictures, videotapes, and graphics. Language courseware became more accessible, offering meaningful contexts for communicative language use and authentic language. The 1980s brought about changing horizons in call, but more was yet to come. Changing horizons during this era, we witnessed the rise of computerized adaptive testing, a significant development in language assessment. The 1990s marked the integration of CD, DVD players and the delivery of media in digital form. Microphones, networking to local and remote servers, word processing, and paint programs became integral to language learning. Centralized internet services, email, and the World Wide Web opened up new possibilities. As we move into the early 21st century, call continues to evolve. Early 21st Century and Beyond The early 21st century brought about the social turn with the advent of Web 2.0. Language learning became more student-oriented, with interactive courses, active and collaborative learning, and co-construction of knowledge. Interactive PDFs became accompanying materials for language courses, enhancing interactivity and engagement. Call has certainly gone through significant stages of development. From its early days with simple audiovisual materials to the digital, interactive, and collaborative world of today. Conclusion In conclusion, computer-assisted language learning, or CALL, has come a long way. With technology constantly evolving, the future of CALL holds even more exciting possibilities, from AI-driven language tutors to immersive virtual environments. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the history and evolution of CALL. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and share it with your fellow language learners and educators. Let us know in the comments about your experiences with call or what you hope to see in the future of language learning technology. Until next time, keep exploring, keep learning, and keep embracing the future of education.